Hi everyone, I've managed to finish another journal. I enjoyed doing the botanical journal so much I made another one with the rest of the page images. Um, so I've used a beautiful navy blue with a gold filigree old book the hitch post and the cotton crochet lace and the plain back. And I've uh, dyed the seam binding the same beautiful beigey colour. As I say, the pages are from the same kit, but they're different. So that's from Ephemeris Vintage Garden, and I've also used an assortment of other pieces from there. So I've left the original inside cover. I've used calico and lace to reinforce. Plus I cut out the rose. Beautiful, beautiful image, this one. And beautiful colours. If you think it's all tea dyed, we've got the uh, satin ribbon with the lovely punch on the side and the rose stencil and this time as you can see I've made it bird themed. So these have all been tea dyed, little cards to journal on. This one's stuck down and then I've used the bowl pin and I've just got a wee tag dangling and the peekaboo bird coming out of the corner there. Now we'll sit back nicely. Some pretty colours through this one. Okay, on this side we've got that lovely large um, cotton crochet lace I love. We've got a tag with the bold pin. You can write on the back if you want. Inside I've shrunk down one of the pages and made a wee book clip from it. And you can journal on the inside. And then a plain large tag sits beside it. My stenciling and journaling pages. Crinkle sound baked in the oven. In the centre, I've done a different shape this time with the double pockets. Little wee tag on the side. Larger tag. Put something in this pocket here if you wanted. This one of the pages shrunk down as a booklet. A lovely tea dyed image I've got on the inside of that one. But maybe that came out of there. And a nice large tag at the back. And those beautiful deep sort of maroni colour tones. Channel pages. One of these beautiful birds and the peekaboo one coming out. This one's got um, poppies on it. Another tag inside the seed packet and a tag inside the glassing bag and the rose stencil on the other side. I'm having a lot of fun using these book covers. I managed to get quite a few but I'm really enjoying the nice size and the lovely feel to them. It's the first signature and you can see the lace through there on the spine. And a lovely card from the same series but they're all different images on them. And the birds at the back match the lovely bird here swinging from the bulb pin. It just sits nicely back in there. German pages. Another fancy page. I put a doily behind it. Glassing bag with a tag. Speed packet with a tag. And the little bird doing the peekaboo matches the one at the bottom. And there's beautiful daisy flowers on that one. Lovely deep navy. Journaling. Centre of this one. Got a beautiful bright page that I've scaled down. Lovely image of the lady and the bird. It just sits nicely in here. The roses on this tag. The tea dyeing patterns. And the same on this side. Another little wee one and a larger one. And on the side it is a pocket as well. And journaling. Nice page on here. We've got roses dangling on the bulb pin. A lovely bird. A little one outside again. And I love how this one turned out. I like putting the birds in the journals. This one will be for sale and listed in my Etsy shop, so I'll put the link down below. It's Treasures by Teresa L. It's this gorgeous page here, the lady in all the roses. With another 
swinging tag here. It's got the roses and the bird on. This one's got the bottom of lilies to it. And the large one at the back. Lovely vintage images and just thought it went lovely in this uh, book cover. Yeah, it's gorgeous. The birds on the back and roses. A couple of the wee tags. Put some lovely lace here and the doily behind. The centre of the signature. This one's all roses as you can see. A large tag on this side. I put the small tag on this one but it also fits on that side. And the, whoops. It's really nice roses on that one. The book page that I've shrunk down. And of course you can journal on the inside. It's lovely pops of colour everywhere with roses and birds and all the things I like. And the journaling pages. A nice crinkle sound to them. The birds. Satin ribbon. And a nice page, beautiful birds in blue and poppies on them again. This matches up with the page. A large tag in the top and then the brown seed pack that I made. The little ones. And I'll pop my name down there. So this is another fun one I've been doing. Thoroughly enjoying this. These book covers are just gorgeous. So thank you all for taking the time to look at it. I really do appreciate it. And as I say, the link to the Etsy will be down below. Thanks everyone.